these are the most popular areas in Miami. This is also on the expensive side, just like the night here ranges from $115 to $180. up guys welcome back to the channel and yes I'm back in town I'm in Miami as you guys can see it feels awesome to be back in the city I feel like it's been a long time but anyway if you're new in the channel first and foremost welcome my name is Milo and I do travel and lifestyle vlogs if you miss my adventures in Mexico for whatever reason nothing to worry about I'll link them up here and I'll also drop the link in the description box below. In today's video, we're going to talk about where to stay in Miami. We're going to explore two different areas. I think these are the most popular areas in Miami. South Beach, which is where we are right now, and the other one, downtown Miami. Now, keep in mind that Miami is a very expensive city to live in and to visit. So keep that in mind when we talk about the prices. Now to do this, we're going to take a look at eight different hotel options, four expensive and four a little bit more affordable. Are you guys ready? Wait, hold on. Before we even go anywhere, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell so you guys get notified when new videos come out. And if you guys want to see a little bit more of my travels and what Miami has to offer, follow me on Instagram. here in South Beach is Hotel Victor. It's just 10 minutes away from Lincoln Road Mall in case you guys want to go shopping. It's also on Ocean Drive, which is right across from the beach. Now, if you want to stay here, a standard room ranges from $180 the night to $290 the night. If you have a car, which again, if you come to Miami, you need a car to drive around the city because the public transportation here it's not the best that's gonna cost you 42 dollars the parking spot here per night and if you want to include the breakfast they do offer continental breakfast here and it costs 20 dollars per person per day so that's something else that you want to add to your budget All right guys, now we're heading over to the next hotel here in South Beach. But in the meantime, I just wanted to share with you guys that Miami is visited by more than 23 million people per year, making it one of the most visited cities in the whole world. Right, guys welcome to our second stop here in South Beach this is the Beacon Hotel and this is also on the expensive side just like the Victor Hotel a standard room here ranges from 170 to 290 dollars but here's the difference they include the continental breakfast so you don't have to pay extra for that now the parking spot that's something that's not included which you have to pay 40 dollars per night so it's a little bit cheaper and for those of you that love to travel with your pets this is a pet friendly hotel Ok 
Okay guys, our next hotel option here in South Beach is more on the affordable side. It's called President Hotel and it's on Collins, just two blocks away from Ocean Drive and the beach. Okay guys, we made it to the next stop here in South Beach. This is the President Hotel and it is also one of the more affordable options here in this area. Like I said, it's just two blocks away from Ocean Drive and the beach. Now here, a standard room ranges from anywhere between $110 the night to $220 the night. The good thing is that they include breakfast, so breakfast is free and it's buffet style breakfast and the parking, they do offer parking spot and it's only $35 the night or as you can see there is plenty of parking in this area as well. Our final stop here in South Beach is the South Beach is the South Beach Plaza Hotel. Now, this is also on the more affordable options. The night here ranges from $115 to $180 the night. The good thing is that they include continental breakfast, so that's for free, nothing to worry about there. If you have a car, which again, you will need, you only need to worry about $35 the night. Or again, as you guys can see here on Collins Avenue, there's plenty of public parking spaces. Check this out. And, Again, if you're traveling with your pet and you're looking for a more affordable option here in Miami Beach, this is the place to go as it is also pet friendly. And just so you guys know, it's actually located on Collins Avenue and 14th Street. Alright guys, welcome to our first stop in downtown Miami. This is on the more expensive side. This is the Intercontinental Miami Hotel. Now, this is one of the most popular hotels here because of the view from up above and the pool deck as well. You can perfectly see the fireworks during Independence Day, July 4th and during Christmas as well that are launched from the Bayside area. And I know you guys must be wondering how much is this hotel? Well, I can tell you that for a standard room, the price goes between $250 all the way to $350. This includes taxes, obviously, but it doesn't include the parking nor the breakfast. If you want to park at the hotel, that's valet parking and it's gonna cost you $48 per night. And if you want to include the breakfast, that's $20 more for two people, which is, not bad but again it's something that you have to take into account if you want to book a stay here in this hotel you know i'm looking for the next stop it's also in the affordable options here in downtown Miami. Oh, it's actually right there. The Holiday Inn Port of Miami Hotel. And it's the perfect spot for tourists as they can buy or purchase any tour right from Bayside. 
In case you guys are wondering, the room here goes from $140 to $220. There's no breakfast included, but if you wanted to include the breakfast, then you have to add $17 per person per day. And if you're driving a car and you need to find a parking spot, well, as you can see, there's plenty of public parking space, but if you wanted to park at the hotel, that's gonna cost you $27 per night. We made it guys to our final stop here in downtown Miami. This is another affordable option here in the city. It's called the Ivy Hotel, which is right over there, right behind me. A standard room here goes from $125 to $190 per night. Now, the only downside to this place here is that they don't have parking available. The only parking option is, as you guys can see, public parking, which from experience, I can tell you that it's extremely, extremely expensive. It's about $10 per hour. They do offer continental breakfast and that comes at an extra cost of $20 per person. It's not that far from the airport. It's just a 15 minute drive. And again, it's right in front of Bayfront Park, Bayside Marketplace. It's a good location, so it's you get one thing, you lose another, but it's nonetheless a pretty good deal. Okay guys, so I hope all of you enjoyed the video. The whole idea was to give you guys a better idea of the hotel cost here, what an affordable option is compared to a more expensive option in both South Beach and downtown Miami, which are two of the most popular areas here. You guys haven't seen my best or my worst video yet, so subscribe to the channel hit the bell so you guys get notified when new videos come out and if you enjoyed the video again hit the thumbs up that will help out a lot don't forget to follow me on instagram and with that from bayfront park i'll see you guys in the next video